Tonight, a raging house fire killed two boys in Paulding County. The flames broke out at Baskin Road and Buckhannon Highway. Fire officials say no adults were home at the time. Thank you for joining us tonight. I'm Russ Spencer. I'm Courtney Bryant. New tonight, Fox 5's Christopher King talks with a neighbor and fire officials about the tragic fire. Firefighters are surveying the damage. The flames destroyed this home. It's now just a burned out husk. The fire chief tells us two boys were trapped inside. I heard an explosion. I turned around. I seen the smoke. Curtis Lewis was working in his backyard when he heard a loud boom. Fire raced through this home across the street. He realized right away he had to act. I just knew it was time to go over and try to do something, but there was nothing I could do. Lewis says he tried to open a door, but it wouldn't budge. It was closed up and I couldn't get the door open. The flames ignited just after 3.15 Friday afternoon. The Paulding County Fire Department says two boys were trapped inside. Our units went in rescue mode and they went through the back window on the split level and they located two victims upstairs. One boy was 17. He died at the scene. A 13-year-old was rushed to a local hospital. He was pronounced dead at Town Grill Records. Joey Pelfrey is the Paulding County Fire Chief. He says the deaths of two boys so young hurt. It rips you apart. It rips this whole community apart. Something like this happened. It hits Lewis especially hard. He says he lost a grandson in a fire. 17, 13-year-old, that's, that's too young to die. I know that. Officials are not releasing the boys' names. They say there were no adults home at the time. The cause of the fire is under investigation. In Paulding County, Christopher King, Fox 5 News. Christopher, thank you.